Here we are at the Beijing Natural History Museum. This place has a tremendous collection of fossils. And this collection has virtually rewritten what we know about the evolutionary history of life. Now among the fossils they have here, they have plenty of feathered dinosaurs. And those are some of the fossils that tell us that birds are actually dinosaurs. Do you know how to say dinosaur in Chinese? Oh, long. And traveling with us is Becky Wu from Taiwan, who wants to become a paleontologist and study fossil birds. Hi, I'm Becky. We're in Beijing now. I'm here to study the birds with Dr. Louis Kiaupe. And I want to become a paleontologist because paleontology is a lot of fun and it's a fascinating science. And it helps us understand the evolution of, of life and put a perspective of how the life is going to develop in the future. My name is Yudi. I am the collection manager of Beijing Natural History Museum. Uh, my work is take care of all kinds of fossils. Uh, my interest uh, is the fossil birds. I think uh, the Chinese fossil birds could tell us uh, where and how the bird evolution from um, which species. Uh, which species? So I want to, I want to introduce you the very wonderful um, Chinese fossil bird. Hi, I'm Maureen Walsh, and I'm the collections manager at the museum's Dinosaur Institute. Right now, I'm in Beijing, China, at the Beijing Natural History Museum's research lab, and I am surrounded from floor to ceiling with the most exquisitely preserved ancient birds. Do you know? Birds are dinosaurs.